What's up guys? It is the Black Man 1467 here bringing you the LP you guys wanted to see. Uh, Mario Kart Super Circuit. Uh, personally, this is one of my favorite Mario Karts. I'd say it's probably my second favorite Mario Kart that I have. So, um, let's start. For, uh, I'll be doing all the tracks for 150cc, including the uh, extra, cra uh, extra tracks. And I'm going to use the randomizer each time to choose the character I will use it for the Grand Prix. So let's see what we have today. Hopefully someone I like. Yoshi, that's an uh, interesting choice. All right, let's go. <clears throat> like I said, personally, I, I like Mario Kart Super Circuit. It's definitely my second favorite, only behind 64 cores. And some, a lot of people do not like this game, and I honestly do not understand why. Uh, a lot of people have a hard time, I guess, con uh, controlling this game, at least on the Game Boy Advance. I personally never really had that problem. Oh, come on. <laughs> to me, uh, personally, uh, I thought, honestly, this game was a bit too easy in terms of AI. On some tracks, you can easily uh, overlap the AI. Like on Cheeseland, believe it or not, I have overlapped the AI so easily on that track. It's unreal. <clears throat> but uh, most people consider this uh, game the black sheep of the family. And personally, like I said, I, I love this game. I, I like the physics of the game. I like the controls of the game. And I like the tracks of the game as well. Wow, that still hit me even with the three red, uh, the green shells. Either way, for, personally for me, in terms of AI, I think this game is a bit too easy compared to 64. But, you know, that's to me. Personally, I, I, I like this game. I love it. <clears throat> I think the tracks are nice, and the remakes of the SNES tracks were amazing. But I do have a gripe about it, uh, the SNES tracks in this game. Although it was nice to bring them back, um, I, I don't like how they didn't bring the uh, they didn't you know put back the obstacles in the game. I felt like that made it way way too easy, and I feel that intelligence system went a bit too lazy on that. But overall, it, this is a great remake. And for people who don't know what remake of this game is, it's obviously Super Mario Kart. So either way, I'm, I'm using Yoshi, and lightweights are the slowest of the group. Uh, of course, behind the middleweights and uh, heavyweights, you guys see the stats, and it says, you know, oh, four-star speed and two weight. Oh, obviously weight, actually, man, it's weight. But when they say speed, which Nintendo kind of, I got to admit, kind of messed up on that, they mean it by acceleration. So, oh, come on. Oh, I'm going to slow down. Yeah, okay. I knew, it's, it, you can outrun the uh, shells in this game, it's just I knew it wasn't going to happen for me considering... Uh, uh, considering that... Uh, oh, I forgot what I was going to say, goodness. Considering the water slows you down, there you go, I was going to say that. Considering the water slows you down, I knew I wasn't going to be able to outrun the shell, but you can outrun red and blue shells in this game. What I also appreciate about the red shells and blue shells in this game, they do act like homing devices, uh, which I think is cool. You can place it behind you, and it waits for your next opponent to pass by, and it'll go after him, he him, or her for Peach, whatever. But it's I think that's a really neat thing that it could do, and I wish Nintendo would implement that in other games, you know, future installments, but I guess not, you know? But if I had to be honest, I'd rather play as heavyweights and middleweights over lightweights. And here's why. I like speed. And although, you know, although um, lightweights offer great uh, handling, they are so slow. They are so slow. It's ridiculous. It's the, you know, this game is actually balanced on like 64. Oh, 64 was definitely not a balanced game but uh like lightweights in the game are actually pretty slow 
Oh man. I, you gotta forgive me, I really do not play lightweights that often. I'm so used to heavyweights and middleweight steering that I'm not used to drifting with characters. And yes, you can drift in this game. See that blue spark that just happened? That means you drifted correctly or long enough to get a boost. Which, which side had the coin again? That's the right side, okay. <laughs> but like I said, in terms of difficulty, this game doesn't really offer a lot. And even on 150cc, it's really, really easy. Like, you, you don't really much of a challenge. So I hope, you know, I gave the uh, speed mod codes to Meaty Guy D, uh, DP, <coughs> who might make a death mode for the game. Cough, cough. Make a death mode, my man. I need a challenge for this game. This game is so easy. But I hope, I hope Meaty Guy DP makes a, a death mode for this game. I would LP that so fast. I really would. But, uh, I would LP that, nope, I would, L, I would LP that so quickly, because I, I play a lot of his death mode in uh, Mario Kart 64. I actually own four of his modes. No, five. See, I own Lucario Mart, 46, uh, death mode, insanity mode, impossible mode, and the super hard mode. Yes, yeah, so I own five. Apparently, he has made ten of them in his other channel. And I really want them all. I might ask him for the codes. I'm like, hey, Meaty, give me, give me all your modes. But of course, this is like Super Mario Kart. Get at least 10 coins so you can get your max speed. Don't need that. Wow. Star, wow, stole a star. Interesting. And that literally is, that's the Mushroom Cup LP. See, I told you how easy this game is ridiculously easy I bet you I got a three-star rating on this watch I'm call I'm calling it I would be surprised if I didn't get a three-star rating that reminds me I'll bring up next episode but there is actually a ranking system in this game the first game to bring a ranking system but I'll talk about that in the next episode or next cup I would say see did I get three stars I knew it. There you go. I called it. Look at that. 146 coins. Because I'm the GOAT. Either way, guys, I hope you enjoyed the Mushroom Cup, and I shall see you in the Flower Cup. And until then, like, comment, subscribe, and I shall see you later.